Today I'm having full access at the most underrated Dolby in the world. A rivalry with the two most successful teams of Austria in one city. With two completely different identities. Welcome to the Dolby of Wien. Both Rabit Wien and Astra Wien were founded in Yitzing of the 13th district of Vienna. Although Rabit Wien have moved further south, the origins of both clubs means that the city is divided between purple and green. And trust me when I say that these two teams are complete opposites. Originally established in 1897 under the name of Wiener Arbeiterfußballclub, Rapid are the people's club, representing the working class heroes. Austria Wien came 13 years later in 1911. In this building, right? Here, where they gather the following of the middle and upper classes. One that is associated with coffee houses. <laughs> I'm also not sure what that means. But these social classes that divide the two have come to define the football that is expected. With Rapids football is proudly more robust than that of Austria, who takes as much pride in playing technical as Rapids do in their aggressive displays. And this derby is one of the most played derbies in the world, with Rapid Wien having won the most championship titles and Austria Wien the most trophies. But now I'm confused, because who is the better team, Rapid or Austria? Well, maybe we will find out today. Because even though both clubs struggle to compete with a club who shall not be named, whenever Rapid meets Austria, this clash becomes more than a football match. Let's go to Vienna. Yes guys, touch down. And I'm in Vienna. A city that is known for its history, legacy in music, beautiful architecture. And today I'm gonna show you why in only one way possible. See, no, never. I mean, this has to be one of the most beautiful cities in the world. This is And that was the beautiful city of Vienna. Now it's time to go to the stadium. I have no idea what to expect, so let's go. It means everything. It's the best derby you can get in Austria. It's the best atmosphere and we are the loudest. The number one in Vienna. This stadium exists for eight years? For eight years. You played all the derbies here yeah. and you lost all of them. Unfortunately. <laughs> How does it happen? Yeah, it feels pretty shit, but today is the day. We destroy them. Okay, thanks so much. Enjoy them. <laughs> and we are inside for the derby. Still one hour to go before this match starts. The West Groove is completely full. They are singing really loud. I mean, what the hell? I didn't expect this. Then the players went out for the warming up. With both ultra stands already completely full with one hour to go before kickoff. And I took my dear friend to this derby. Bro, Rapid have never won in this stadium against their arch enemy, so I'm gonna reverse jinx this today. <laughs> Both fan bases are loud out there. All in purple here, all in green there. It's just insane. Then the players were getting back inside yeah, and the fans got ready out. for the derby. And you can already see a big banner in the middle of the West School family. I'm so excited for this match. It is so loud here. Like if these fans aren't underrated, I don't know who else are. So let me know in the comments down below what you think. You can see the preparation behind me. Let's go, Wiener Derby! I love it! 
that's also what this dome is about. A good relation with the players and the fans. Here we go! And of course also big respect to that away end. I mean those fans are also putting a lot of effort into their atmosphere and I think it looked amazing. The question is are we gonna see some pyro? Like Bro, some pyro. do you think we're gonna see some pyro? I think we all like to see from the... yeah? Oh! Okay. You can tell this army means everything to the fans. <laughs> Some serious challenges for Rapid here. They are pressing for the 1-0. Wow. I think they don't like Australia now. The whole stadium is part of the atmosphere and it looks sick. Both set of fans were creating an amazing atmosphere when Rapid Wien got another chance. The West Group is kicking off. Same atmosphere. I don't want to sound negative that I'm surprised, but I mean, I didn't expect this kind of atmosphere. They planned Pyro together with a goal. That's the dream of every over us then. And I think they've silenced the way in for now. They celebrated like a goal. That's what this derby means to them. Throughout the whole game there is Pyro here. I'm not too sure what to think about it because I also really like organized Pyro. Do you prefer organized Pyro or Pyro throughout the whole match? Let me know in the comments down below because I'm also really curious about your opinion. But I gotta say 2-0 behind and the away it is still singing. Oh, first real chance for Austria V. They might come back in this game. Nope. What the hell man, it is so loud here and of course they are the Brit Faro. <laughs> Eight years they can call themselves the number one of Vienna. <laughs> What do you think of that? <laughs> Pole stand singing, jumping, chanting. I'm the baddest ever seen that in my life. Wow. <laughs> and that's our time. 3 0. Here we go, second hole.
respect, 3 0 behind in their derby of the year. And this, this is what I call support. <laughs> There is obviously too much smoke now. But with that insane away support, the West Kurve also had to turn it up a notch. And again, Tom Ultras are ready. I think we're gonna see something epic. And that's what I 3 0 after 8 years. The curse has been broken. They're gonna celebrate with these amazing fans. Stay tuned for the giveaway. It's gonna be a bit harsh for those away players to face the away fans. I mean, they gave everything. That's always painful. These fans are insane. That's just goosebumps. Congratulations to all of our bit events. They are leaving the pitch and they are celebrating. That's how cool a derby can be. I mean, they have to sit and watch how they celebrate. Every football fan also knows what that hurts. And that was another crazy derby experience. Are these one of the most underrated fans? Let me know in the comments down below. If you want to win this scarf, just leave a comment down below. Like this video and subscribe to the channel. You decided that let's go to Vienna, so we did. Hey, it's, it's crazy here.